take it slowly. Oh, give me a minute. There's something I need to do. First, come on. I'm gonna do. Right. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Fight the gap. Guess. I'm confused. Oh. oh. Found him. Found the guess. They're over there. All right. So, same as usual. Shit. They aren't actually over there. Fuck. Not good. Shit. There are a lot of geth here. Hello, geth. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. I want out, damn it. Get face down. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Slight hole damage. If ever slight hole damage. There we go. Now we can move on to the final one. Uh. Ugh. Hmm. Uh, we can finally go to the next one, which is. Um, Oh, for the love of God, we've already done this. We're only halfway done. Two down, two to go.
Okay, so where the fuck are we going? This place looks like fucking vault. Alright. Northeast. mineral is this? Magnesium. Okay, now we just add east. Yes. Actually, it should be right over these hills. Yeah, these can be classified as hills and not mountains. They're not big enough to be mountains. Armature. Oh shit, that's Colossus. Did that guess fall down yesterday? Fucking shit. Should I do for the fucking squad mates? Oh. Ugh. And into the final one. Gagarin. Okay, who the, who the fuck came up with the names for this shit? Oh, I can survey this world. Oh, more matriarch writings. That's always good. What about the most far looking planet? It's on the most far looking planet. Actually, I don't think this has any lava or magma. 
not most. It's not like most of then. It's a moon. Or is that its moon? Is this the moon or is that the moon? Questions. This is a moon. Almost certainly this is a moon. Approaching the overrun research base. My question is, what the fuck is it overrun with? It's overrun with Geth. Now that I think about it, Geth are honestly really the most, like the most Geth opponents. In Mass Effect 1. So you primarily fight Geth. Occasionally you kill humans, obviously. Or Asari, or Solarians, or Turians, but... Not as frequently as Geth. I mean, the Geth are primarily the fucking assholes you're killing. It's the Geth. I don't know why, but something... Yeah. Okay, this place sounds unstable. Let's uh, get inside and shoot him up. Oh, god damn it. We're gonna be fighting husks. God damn it. This music does not help at all. Yeah, the high pitched sounds of making it sound like you're alone. That. No. Stop it, game, please. Alright. Kill some husks. Oh, for the love of God, another place like this. Take out. Okay, primary question. Can I hack this? Nope, wrong thing. Uh. No. Oh, shit. Positively charged. Oh shit. I don't get back. Uh, okay, so it was after me. Why though? Oh shit, there's a ship behind me. Oh shit. Put that up. Oh, hello. Oh, good job. Alright. Let's see if we can manage 
damage this. Where did they come from? Area secured. Where did the Geth come from? Why are Geth here? Why? G7, light turning armor. Hmm. Oh, shit. There's actually a item limit. Yes, I fucking know I'm nearing the item limit game. Yeesh. Point. Ditching all this fucking armor. Especially the medium and heavy armors. I can't wear it. No one else can. Okay. Destroy all the shotguns. At this point, I could literally just sell all this shit. I should have almost forgot about the level up. Uh There we go. Uh, almost forgot about everyone else. Oh. Alright, final room. Was that? Huh. Okay, well, put in a combat scanner. Okay, tungsten round six. We will keep on using a kinetic stabilizer, which we have effectively all of. Okay. I guess there's nothing more in this base. Which means there's no Geth base here. Because this was built by fucking people. Not fucking sentient murderous robots. how much the Geth were similar to the fucking Terminators. Only difference is they don't want to fucking... They're not trying to be humanity. Hmm. Oh, shit. Back. Where'd I park the... Where'd I park the fucking Mako? Let's get back to the Mako. They... They fucking set up an ambush. This is odd. 
I would have expected one of these outposts to be a main base of operations for the Geth incursion into this region. Hold on. This receiver's picking up some kind of transmission. Based on the signal strength, I'd say it's coming from inside this star cluster. It must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and eliminate them. Okay, it good. must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and eliminate them. Okay then. Well, now we have to fucking look around for a fucking new Geth base. Good. Why can't the Geth be more simple? <sighs> Somewhere in here, but where? Not Jinthorn, actually. Okay, it's the first planet. Okay, what about Saka? Nope. So, so jealous. I don't fucking know how to pronounce this shit. It's not anti-rum gun. We got light metal. Okay. Pressure. Pressure. I don't know. Oh, interesting. So he's not. Okay, I guess it's so Oh. Wait a minute. Why the hell is this name Grissom? This isn't where Grissom Academy is, is it? Oh, survey. Survey says... Medallion. Okay, what about this one? Oh, more survey worlds. More light metals. What about this? Mm -hmm. And okay, so this is where the Geth have their base. Fuck we going. Straight ahead. Oh, you know, this looks similar to the moon from uh Agents of Shield. I can't remember what the fuck the name of it was. We can start with an M. Shit. They really have the fucking far range of reach and detection, don't they? Oh dear god. Oh, fuck you, Colossus. Okay, 
Okay, fuck it. We're taking your glasses with us. Okay, we're not taking it with us. Shit, shit. Oh wait, never mind. Never mind. Okay. Shit. Okay, we need a distance. You get. Okay, I cannot fucking hit those. Yes, Alright, fuck you. Yes. Okay. Yep. Okay. Here we go. This should be a safe place. All right. When in doubt, assault rifle is always better than a sniper rifle. Especially when you have overkill. There we go. Like I said, better than overkill. Or better than a sniper rifle. At least at the moment. If I had the ability to use a sniper rifle effectively, I would. But sadly, I'm not trained to use a sniper rifle. Because fuck me, that's why. I can hear them. They do not sound happy. Huh. Looks like I should probably use this. That's the death and not Oh sh fuck. Nope, 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 stay there. Oh shit. bad. My bad. Entirely my bad.
Yeah, I am definitely gonna claim all that is my fault. There's a very specific reason. Uh, well, let's search this place up, then talk with Tali back on the Normandy. Yeah, I just realized these aren't Sarens, Geth. Of course there's nothing up here. You lead, I'll follow. Mm hmm. Yeah, everything will be explained and eventually in Mass Effect 2. Speak with Tully. Oh shit, I almost forgot to speak with Rex after his, uh, like fetching his armor as well. probably talk with Garrus as well. Commander, I wanted to thank you. What for, Garrus? For everything. Taking me with you, letting me be part of your team. I've learned a lot. I'm, uh... Thanks, Commander. You're welcome, Garrus. Hey. Oh, shit. I almost forgot one thing. I keep always forgetting. If I can turn my game volume back up. Never a dull moment with you, Shepard. You ever go on any missions like ours before? Saving the galaxy from certain destruction? No. But I've had my share of adventures. Hmm. Do you remember any that stick out? A few. I remember one time I was hired by a Volus diplomat. What an ass. Huh. What did he want you to do? He wanted me to erase his past. Get rid of an old friend who knew too much. Huh. His old friend turned out to be an Asari commando. I can see why that might give you pause. What? No. Alina and I were old friends. Sort of. We met when we were both contracted to kill the same Turian. Neither of us wanted the other one to get him first. We spent more time fighting each other than tracking that Turian. Huh. An Asari hey. commando mercenary? That's unusual, isn't it? I wouldn't say it's unusual. Mercs come in all shapes. <laughs> anyway, when I told Alina about the diplomat's contract, she and I had a good laugh about it. So what did you do? I guess well, you shot her. Or he shot her. I wasn't going to lose her. He shot her. But I respected Alina. In the end, I let her pick the location where we'd fight. She chose some old Solarian space station overrun with mercs and smugglers. That way we didn't have to worry about hurting any innocent bystanders. Hmm. <laughs> He always was a bit of a softie. What happened on the station? What didn't happen? For two days, I chased her through that station, used my entire store of ammunition, had to kill a bunch of mercs and use their crap weapons. By the third day, the station was barely holding together. The mercs were dead or gone, life support was failing, but I had her. She'd locked herself in the med labs, 
she was trying to patch herself up. Damn tough, that one. Then just when I thought I had her, the station's core went critical. Barely made it back to my ship in time. Huh. I assume the Asari Commando didn't make it? I watched the station from a distance. I never saw her leave. And when that place blew, there was nothing left larger than a Turian's right nut. So I headed back to the diplomat to give him the good news and collect my pay. But before I got halfway there, Alina sent me a message. Better luck next time. <laughs> now, I'm not superstitious. But if someone can survive that, well, they deserve to live. At least for a bit longer. Huh. What about the diplomat? He wanted her dead. I told him the truth. <laughs> Alina was still alive and she was really pissed. I told him if he wanted to live, he'd need me around to protect him. Huh. You're smarter than you look, Rex. <laughs> he kept me on as his personal guard until he died. Natural causes. Easiest job I've ever had. A little boring, but credits are credits. So long, Rex. Rex, the most intelligent of the Krogan. Well, one of the most intelligent of the Krogan. He's probably one of the few Krogan that would le they would prefer the Krogan Hold on, okay, let me try and rephrase this. One of the few Krogan that doesn't want their people to die off slowly. Shepard, I need to talk to you. It's important. Is something wrong? You know the data you took from those Geth control nodes? The information you uploaded to Alliance Control? I want a copy of it. Okay. You want to bring this data back to the migrant fleet? Those files have information that could be vital to our efforts to understand the Geth. It could be the key to helping us reclaim our home world. You think you can use this information to destroy your enemy? Not right away. We will need to study it. It could take years, but it will give us new insight into how the Geth have changed and evolved over the past centuries. Go ahead. Make a copy. My people, I... Owe oh, you a great debt, one I can never repay. The only thing I can offer in return is what you already have. My solemn promise to stay with you until Saturn and his Geth armies are defeated. I never wanted anything more. Thank you, Shepard. Hey, Bergen. <laughs> okay, what fucking next? Uh, what else do we have? I don't care about that. All right, we're going back. We're gonna have to go back there eventually. Yeah, let's go back to the Citadel. We could hop our way back to the uh, Novaria, do the smuggling, get the shit, you yeah, know. As long as we don't get renegade. Speaking of which, where am I at? Beforehand. Uh. Fuck it. All right. Ah, fucking elevators. Fucking elevators. Alright, here we go. Go back to the Citadel. Message from Admiral Hackett, Commander. Son of a Patching bitch. it through. We just received your report. Looks like this Geth incursion was bigger than we thought. They were probably preparing for a major offensive in the system. 
We're increasing patrols in the Armstrong cluster to make sure they can't establish another foothold in the region. Nice job, Shepard. You saved a lot of human lives on this mission. Hack it out. Uh, yeah, here's the thing. I do not think those were Saren's Geth. Or that they were planning a, uh, any sort of fucking offensive at all. Look, uh, fuck it, we'll go back to Novaria. Effect one. Oh, God, this is going to be boring. <laughs>